hoot hoot. So aside from just having like an incredibly loud, obnoxious apartment, like there's constant noise, bass, everything, it's really quite annoying. Aside from just that, I've discovered that I also have another problem. And this one is perhaps a little less significant, and from the perspective of a, of a viewer, which there are very few, but from the perspective of a viewer, it's actually kind of nice. Um, I have like a gear addiction? Not gear like steroids, um, surprisingly enough, I know I'm huge. <laughs> no, but uh, I have an addiction to gear when it pertains to video making. So. Obviously, I bought this new microphone. I'm loving it. It's super great, despite the fact that it's very sensitive. Um, I, I'm kind of thinking maybe I should have gone with a dynamic mic, but I think that this is more applicable to tons of different stuff, as opposed to the dynamic microphone, which is probably just useful for streaming. Anyway, because um, like I, I'm thinking about buying like another microphone, but like a shotgun one, and some gear to make actual videos. And, I mean, obviously that's completely unnecessary and, quite honestly, a bit excessive. But, like, I worked this summer, I have the money, and I'm gonna wait until Christmas-ish time when I have a little bit more money from, you know, like, grandmothers and stuff to decide on whether or not I want to do that, or even if I'm still doing this semi-regularly. I mean, I do a video almost every day at this point. But for me, it's, it's kind of more... Like, is it... Everybody always says, oh, is it worth it? Is it worth it? I mean, like, I'm enjoying it, so yeah, it's it's worth it. I would much rather spend, you know, like, $200 on this crap than $200 on, like, uh... That's a bad example, because I probably also spend $200 on alcohol. But I, I meant $200 on this as opposed to another vice, like alcohol or drugs. Um, disregarding everything I just said since I'm 20. Um, we're just gonna kind of like talk about gear and gear mentalities as a whole, I guess. I'm super interested in having the best stuff possible. I'm not gonna upgrade my camera. I've, I'm standing resolute in the fact that I do not need a new camera. But I also believe that if you have good audio, it makes the video seem better. And what I mean by that is when you're looking at a video and it looks like garbage, but it sounds amazing, then somewhere subconsciously in your brain, you think this is a higher production value video. And I mean, that's true of a lot of things. If you look at one of my favorite YouTube channels for learning this kind of thing, uh, DSLR Guide, he has a trash, just, I mean, no offense, he kind of has a trash camera. It's about as good as mine, which is also kind of trash. but. The interesting thing is he's able to make these really high production things by just investing in other gear, like lighting and, and oh my god, my mouth is making so many noises, but he's investing in lighting and, and all this interesting equipment, like, like a microphone, for instance. And I'm thinking if I just get some good lighting and a nice microphone, I can start making more videos pertaining to real life stuff, like skits. I made a couple skits in the past, I really enjoyed them. They're some of my most well-received and popular videos. Please see The World is Flat video. It has like 300-something views, which is insane compared to the rest of my content. But that's the plan for now. I'm gonna keep doing this thing. Maybe by the time winter rolls around, I'll have like three whole subscribers. How do I pick things up again? Middle mouse button, right mouse button. Um, that, not that. Uh, uh, can't use. Oh, that's bad. I should not shoot that. Okay, well, I shot it anyway. Um, I don't really know how I'm gonna get past this shit. I guess I'll just do it the old-fashioned way. We're doing it live! Sick. Nailed it. First try. Anyway, but that's that's my, my mentality, my idea on... Oh my god, was it seriously just E? How did I not hit that the first time? Oh, let's try to avoid these guys. Oh, pro oh what the heck? That's some bullshit. Oh, I'm dead as hell. I'm dead sec right now, boys. Oh my god, there's like eight of them. Oh my god, they have me. Oh, I'm so dead. Oh no 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 no. Oh no 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 no. Oh no no. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, well, beep 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 beep. User fatality. Nice. I love, I love, with a burning passion, these subtitles. God, I couldn't think of the word. I'm going to get idiot. 
that's all. That's my biggest gripe with Valve games right there. Fucking, we were playing Portal 1 with some friends the other day, and obviously they'd never played a, like, a video game before. That's like the introductory video game, you know? Like, oh man, this person will love Portal, because Portal's just a great game. And they would die, and then we'd be sitting there for like 10 minutes, like, just bullshitting and like, waiting for it to load. Because, you know, like, the game takes a while to load. It's kind of shit. Source Engine is actually garbage. But we'd be waiting there for a little bit, and then we'd be like, oh, you can't, oh, yeah, you have to hit something to make it load. That's the dumbest thing ever. Just load. Like, what do you think? We're gonna just want to sit around and do nothing? No, fuck that. We want to play the game again. Why do you make us click to load? Just load. It's not rocket surgery, man. So we're just gonna do this the correct way this time, and just bust a nut on all these fools. Uh, get wrecked. Oh, this is the right way. I thought I was going the wrong way for a second. I mean, this is gonna be like a super long video. I just kind of wanted to, oh my god, that was the loudest mouth click I've ever had. It was like, that was like 20 decibels. That was insane. Anyway, it's not gonna be a super long video. I'm just kind of like, I wanted to give my perspective on it, tell you that there probably will be upgrades coming in the future. Um, just cause like, I can, you know, like, I'm at a good point in my in my life right now where I can afford to do stupid shit like like buy tons of expensive electronic equipment for a YouTube video or for a YouTube channel that's never gonna take off. But if it does, man, I can rub it in my parents' face. So that's what we're gonna do right now. So I'm I'm 20 years old, right? And I've been doing this YouTube thing for God, I don't know, like six years. And my entire life, I've been buying equipment doing stuff like that and everybody's been saying john you're a freaking idiot nobody's gonna ever watch you you're never gonna get that money back i'm gonna prove them fucking wrong i'm gonna prove them so fucking wrong and you're gonna help me i don't care who you are watching this you're gonna subscribe you're gonna like the video and you're gonna tell all your damn friends about this fucking video and you're gonna tell them subscribe or i'm gonna fucking find them and i'm gonna make them subscribe that got really aggressive really quickly. But I mean, like, you get the idea, right? Just freaking do it. Help me help you. And by help you, I mean just help me become rich and famous. I already have the, uh, pretend I don't know nobody down. Now I just need to get rich, you know? I need to blow the fuck up and pretend I don't know nobody. I'm well aware that that is not, in fact, the quote. I can't remember the quote. Doesn't fucking matter, okay? Fucking subscribe. You know what? End video. Bam. Drop the mic. I'm not gonna drop the mic. It's kind of expensive. It's on a shitty boom par boom boom arm boom boom palm. Bye. Toodaloo. See ya.